Good afternoon, dear friends. Dalun Ndibu. We gather that Ohanes the Ndibus, they are destroying Igbo culture, tradition, and everything we have, in the sense that all of them live outside Igbo land. All the members of Ohanes the Ndibu, all of them lived outside Igbo land. They own properties, what of billions, trillions of pounds and dollars. They own it outside Igbo land. They own companies outside Igbo land, what of trillions of pounds and dollars. All of them are located outside Igbo land. They are landlords uh, in Lagos, Abuja, Kanu, Kaduna. They own mansions, stairs outside Igbo land. And we asked, are they doing us better or they are doing us uh, bad? They are doing us very bad thing by showing that bad example. That's why what is happening in Igbo land is not giving them consign because they chose another man's land to be built. They chose to live there and speak the people's language. Um, the worst part is that they don't speak our language while holding the meeting. We gathered from right source. We gathered right information that the language they used to hold their meeting is English language and none of them can speak Igbo language. They use English as the official language. And we are asking, are they destroying Igbo language and culture or are they promoting it? Uh, that is the big question they have to answer. If it is true, then they are not worthy to be our leaders. They are not worthy to answer Ohanes and Dibu. Then we cannot condemn them now by just male hearing. We have to send spies to go and spy them and give us proper information. Capture them on camera and give us so that we post it on the social media to make sure what we are saying is true so we need help from any uh, everybody to go where they are doing their meeting and make sure that what we are hearing is true because we cannot conclude now before you conclude anything you have to make proper investigation if it's true that they are using english to hold their meeting. They are not worthy to answer or harness them. They are not answer, uh, uh, they are not worthy to be our leaders. So we need help. Anybody that can volunteer, please do it fast. Before they will answer or harness them, they will first go back to Igbo land and establish, relocate, build their companies in Igbo land. And they, again, they say that all of them, they don't have even butter in their father's compound, but they have mansions, stairs, companies, worth of trillions and pounds and dollars and naira outside Igbo land. What are they portraying? Are they uh, showing the world that they don't love their land or they don't love their culture, religion, uh, I, I mean, a uh, culture, tradition. They don't love it. Is what they are showing indirect. Everybody lived in their own land. Oba of Bini lived in Bini. Emi of Kano or Kaduna, they live in Kano and Kaduna. Oba of, of Lagos and others, all of them based in their land. But the Igbo or Haneze, all of them based either in Lagos or Abuja or, uh, or Kaduna or Kano. They are there ruling the, the Igbo land. And now, you see on them, is it a good thing to do? If they are doing so, which means they are using their hands to destroy their own. That is why what is happening in the, our land is not giving them consign. They are not saying anything about it because they know they are secured. They have run away from their own ancestral land and they decide to choose another man country and they say that they are Ohanes and Bibu. We have to know 
we have to find out. So we need everybody's support. We need everybody to put hands on this and make this investigation. Then get back to us. When you get back to us, we need your video. The video, we need to capture them on camera to be sure so that we have evidence. Go inside where they are doing their meeting and find out whether they are using English. If they are using English, then on her name, then they needed to be bound. They needed to be destroyed. They needed to be cancelled. So, please, everybody should join hand. So, let's start to look inwardly and know where our problem is coming from. If it's coming from her, then you will see that we have a very big problem. We are here to promote our language and culture. And the people that call themselves our leaders, they are using English to hold their meetings. And they live, all of them live outside Igbo land and say that they are our mouthpiece. If all of them have companies and live outside Igbo land, then they are not worthy to be our leaders. Then they will they, they needed to be bound, they needed to, to be destroyed. But before we do that, we have to, to, to look and have evidence at hand. That is today's topic. And let's go, let's go to spy, let's go to investigate. I will thank anybody that will give us the video and the pictures. You know, pictures speak volume and the video also. We need video, not picture. We thank you in advance, anybody that will do that. Thank you and remain blessed. Bye for now.